just going to make sure this is working. Yeah, there you go. How about that? Make sure that we're uh, everything's working properly. <clears throat> Lucky there, we're working. We're working on YouTube as well. Oh, is that working? I think we're working. I think we are working. So I've got you guys in here. Ideally, you cannot see me. You can just see the tape that we're going to be watching, ideally. Please confirm that that is accurate. Hey, Gage. Hey, Jacob. Uh, we're trading out of the top five. I'm not trying to pick in the top five. Trade out of that. All right. So I'm in my restream. In order to see my chat... Let me see. Okay, the chat's right here. No? Huh. Chill out, CD. Chill out. Um, what if I maximize my window? Then will I get a chat? There it is. There's my chat. Okay. All right. Looky there. All right, guys. Let me send out a tweet real quick. Thank you, CD. That is the sound of throwing a ball that hits the food bowl, in case you're wondering. I'm not breaking anything. Texas Joseph. Osai. Osai. Uh, okay, we're almost ready. Sorry, guys. Testing things here. I wasn't sure if my restream was going to work. But now, I believe you guys can see the tape, which is lovely. And I can see the chat, which is lovely. Let me see if I can separate this one. If that will still be what you see. All I want from there is the chat. Okay, I can see the chat. I'm pulling up my tape window. And you guys can still see. That's YouTube. You guys can still see it. Yes, yes, yes. <clears throat> I need to pull this one out. Okay, there's that. There's that. Okay, everything is set up the way I need it to be set up. Uh, no, Jacob. So you guys can see the tape, yes? You can see the film. You can see the screen of the Texas game. See, I swear on everything. We're going to be watching number 46, Joseph Asai. Let me find where he is. On Dane, you can't just bark. You got to bring me the ball if you want to. Play. Nope, that's not what we're going to do. Stop. Where's the ball? Your brother's barking. Why? Bring me the ball. Where is it? Let me give you the prank. 
of Osai. All right, number 24. Dane has him listed 6'2", 255. Texas lists him 6'4", 250. Dane is usually going to be right on those things. He gets it from other scouts. All right, hit and play. Sorry, guys. Here we go. First, got to find number 46. I would assume they're going to have him being the stand-up guy at the bottom of the line. <coughs> Good news is when you have coaches, film, we'll know who he is in a second. Bam. Okay. Okay. So there's six. Right defense is where he is. He is at right defensive end. He's in a stand up stance right now. Run him down, sir. Run him down. Oh, I don't know yet, Brian. My trade ideas are still very raw. I'm just trying to trade down. So the guys who I already have all 22 film of from 2020, I just want to make sure that I'm getting them watched. And, okay, here he's on the left side. Because if you trade down, like some of the guys I've been watching, instead of using a top, say, six or eight pick, trade down a little bit. Maybe you come away with South Carolina's J.C. Horn and this guy, Asai, both potentially mid to late first rounders. All right. I'm going to try really hard to concentrate when my dogs are trying not to let me. All right. So he's playing a stand-up edge, which works here. He's playing a long arm there. Two. Let's look at that again. So you see what we're going to do here is we're going to be playing the run. So we're not always looking for our guy who is an edge, whether it be a, quote, linebacker or, quote, defensive end. We're not always looking for him to just, hey, run around the offensive tackle. Show me how fast and how athletic you are. Sometimes you have to play run, which in this case, he's going to use one straight arm. Bam. To control that offensive tackle. His eyes are on the ball. He's going to see where it is, and then we want him to get rid of the offensive tackle and go get the ball. That works. We really, with him, I don't think we're going to need to do the wide angle. We can just skip. We'll see. Why is my laptop running with crab? Is this skipping for you guys? I hope it's not. I'm sorry. There he is on the left side, number 46, Osai. I think that offensive lineman <laughs> tripped on a foot there. Yeah, they basically are, Jeremy. My dogs are being super annoying right now. I may have to do this on my desktop PC. Let me see if it gets a little better. Six, that's not allowed. You can watch Stearns, wherever he is. The stand-up fits here. Down the line there is nice, too. I'm going away from you, what are you going to do about it? In his case, the answer is, I'm going to run hard, and that's good. All right, we're at the bottom here going against the left tackle.
All right, CD's eating a stick. We're just going to make a giant mess in here, but we're going to shut up. We're icing our backs so we can golf in the morning, or at least try to golf in the morning. We'll not hurt ourselves. Well, I take that's what you want out of a 250 plus pounder. Six here. Balls away. There is no quit there. Oh, I don't know, Caleb. I'm just now getting locked in. Takes me, uh, takes me a minute to get thin sometimes. I'm locked in now. I think they got him in the right role there. He's an edge guy that he can stand. probably put his hand on the ground too if you want him to. He gets down the line really well. He's got a mow that runs hot. He flashed a little straight. Arm is a run defender, which at 250 55 pounds is nice. I love his little DB stand <laughs> on the edge. So when you're going to 50 pounds or so, you're going to get moved sometimes. It's just a fact of life. Yeah, Mario, I can find you a fat guy. Find you a fat guy. That is a pass rushing stance. Our guys get ready to go. All right, so in the notes, you will have um, really good as a backside pursuer in the run game. Speed and motor. It looks like he'll always be the stand-up guy. So both sides, he flips around. Oh, that is nice. This will be a good rep to watch. He's not going to get a sack, but... Gosh, that's nice. That's just... The right arm beating the tackle with that punch he keeps himself free because he's playing with a little bit of lean. He wins the punch battle. He can turn the corner. I like this guy. Oh, they tricked you. I was about to say, wow, nice rush. And, nope, they wanted that to be a nice rush. In the future, I'll do these on the PC so it runs a little smooth. I don't know what's going on with the laptop right now, but I'm going to call it good enough. Let's see, what's your responsibility here, 46? Is that getting too far upfield? Is that kind of, yeah, it could have. Ideally, what you want to see happen here is you want to see him recognize the pole. So right here, you want to see him recognize that the other side of the line is pulling because that's going to tell you what's happening. And the last thing you're going to want to do is get way upfield here. You would love to destroy the offensive lineman and blow this play up. Just drop your shoulder into him. Running upfield just creates room for him to run there.
what might hurt this guy a little bit is if Dane has the measurables up right. If he's 6'2 and not 6'4, and if he's not a long-armed guy, it becomes a little bit harder to project that he'll be able to do some of the things he's doing to these tackles, keeping them off of you with that straight arm. A little too upfield here. Oh, we're out. That's 52. Let me make sure he's not on the other side with a hand on the ground, and then we will know, skip plays until he's back in. Yep, he's out. Tweener for the Cowboys right now shouldn't really matter because of what they're running. Alden Smith stands up. Tank stands up sometimes. Gregory stands up sometimes. A tweener works here, and I don't care about tweeners to begin with. That's an archaic NFL thing. Still out here. Still out. What's up, Kevin? Now we're in. Over 74 here. That's a nice job. He was held there. <clears throat> That's an uncalled hold. 74 is a big old boy. Keeps himself clean. He gets off the block, and he's out there to make the tackle if he doesn't get old. Throw the flag, ref. Run, baby, run. He will do that. It's great when you check the motor box. And he checks the motor box. And he goes and runs a 4-5. That's going to be nice, too. I'm just not to the late rounders yet, Curtis. I am just getting started. Number 46, again, this is Joseph Osai, if you're just joining us, University of Texas. He's the stand-up guy on the line. Appreciate you, Zach. You're a beast. So you can see he's got some power in the lower body. When he first gets into these guys and he gets that arm, he's getting them moving, but he doesn't really have that sustained power to keep overpowering dudes that are 300 and something pounds. Chipmunk's in here watching <laughs> Stern, even paying attention to him. <laughs> Our guy's got a burst to him. He's got some. He's got some quickness. There's a guy at the Cowboys that used to give broadest crap when we were watching tape. He's like, what, "Who are you watching?" And Brian would name one guy, and he'd be like, "Oh yeah, watch the guy next to him too." And Brian's like, "How do you watch tape on guys at once?" He's like, "You can't." Yeah. That's what happens with the 250-pound edge. That's what you don't want to happen is boing, getting blown out of the hole. You got to chop him down or find a way around him. I don't know, Josh. We hear Marinelli wants upfield penetrators, but then he picked, he wanted taco. And it's like, what? That's not anything like the guys that you like. So I don't know. He's inconsistent. 
Oh yeah, I'm not Hunter. I'm not looking at this guy as a top ten pick. I'm looking at him as a trade down somewhere late first, second. I don't know. I'm just watching guys. I use Dane's list to get started. He's in his top twenty five, so I happen to have twenty twenty tape on, so I watch it. a little tough when you get so much zone read stuff because it's hard for your guys to know on each rep am i pass rushing here or do i have to slow play this edge in case the quarterback pulls it Getting blocked there oh i don't care lewis i don't like i don't want to be in the top five in this draft i don't think there's any dominant there's no Stud prospect at the top, other than Sewell, the offensive tackle. I think those corners and the pass rushers, those are guys you want to pick in the top 15, but not in the top five. I've seen so much money. If I'm going to pick a guy way up there, I want the Bosa, Miles Garrett. Um, you know, those kind of guys. Ramsey. That's what I like though. When he gets when he gets extended on a guy, this would go in the notes. He does a really good job with his eyes of tracking the ball and then finding a way to disengage himself and get involved in the play. So on the defensive line standing up. And on this play, he's just hanging out. Maybe I'll see if I have any Miami 2020 tape already. I don't know if I do yet. Uh, I don't know yet, Colin. I don't have a comp for him at the moment. 6'2", two, over 250. Good burst. Athletic. I don't know yet. Oh, Lewis just signed Gilbert. Don't worry about Becca. Let's have some fun. There it is again. If you run away from this guy, he's going to be involved. You're going to want to run right at him. You don't want to run away from him. He's standing up here across for 56. Can't leave this guy as an unblocked backside. He's going to catch up. Yeah, Diego, I think we will. I think we'll see an eye as it gets closer to the end. And hopefully, as the Cowboys are out of it, the problem is it's hard for him to be out of it because the division's so bad. I've not seen him in a three point yet, Chipmunk. I've always seen him standing up. It's not bad. He's playing contain on that motion when he's attacking the play. Did he just do a Hail Mary before the play? Ah, almost. Oh, he got held. Drew a flag. Wentz is a problem right now, sir. It's a good job. He does a good job. That's encouraging to be 250. And when TC is running at him, I don't have, I have no idea if their tackles are any good. But when they're running at him, he holds the point. He gets extended. He disages. He gets to the ball. <laughs> He's going to be a good stunt player. I'll, I'll just say, did I complete that? This one's going to be fun. Watch him I'm run a little stunt here. Whoop. Bow. Let's 
I like this guy. I will, Sean. I will watch every prospect that goes to the Combine or the Senior Bowl. I will watch them all, just a matter of as the tape comes in. So what our guy has is he's got sort of power in his punch, but he doesn't – he just doesn't have the sustained power to walk guys back. Oh, I think we're out here. Sure, that's not. No, it's not our guy. Our guy's out. Our guy's out. Our guy is out. Our guy is out. Uh, I think our guy is in. Nope, no, that's 40. Pretty sure that was not our guy. Well, it is our guy, isn't it? That's our guy. Nice play. It's a powerful finisher, too. Yeah, I don't think you're going to ask this guy to get bigger. I don't know what he's doing there. <laughs> he's gonna drop in and then do wild stuff. All right, dog. I'll look out. Here I come. Rice my back a little bit. Over there on the stunt. TCU picks it up. Yeah, Wesley, we uh yeah, we paid it out. It was like almost twenty six thousand dollars, I think. Which is really cool. Thank you to the people who donated. I keep Cheeto and Draft Corner. Is Cheetos cheap? <clears throat> Oops, we paused. Did I miss a play there? Look, the dog again. Where you chipmunk wherever you line up is where your coaches tell you to line up. There's not you don't have corners out here winging it, picking where they line up. I mean, Blake, if you want to go for Team Fifty Burger and go pick pits, I ain't mad at you. But you can't do that if it's your only first round pick. Yes, I did, Vach. Yes, I did. If you're in here, make sure you're following Vach too. It's my guy. Good draft man. Good cowboy man.
See, even on these plays that don't accomplish anything, you can see it's a nice little rip move with his inner arm, the left arm here, and you can see how quickly he can bend that corner. Whoop. If he tests well athletically, he'll definitely be a first rounder. <clears throat> See, there's that initial power, but not sustained power. So I'm kind of moving you, and then after you, if you can withstand it and recover, I'm about to get tossed. Whoop! <laughs> Oh, heck yeah, Blake. We're in our run defense stance here. All row corner. And he's a lot better when you run at him than you would think for a guy his size. And a lot of it's just the activity. That's good with your hands, too. He beats these guys' punch. He keeps himself free. It's good. Again, if you're just joining us, we are watching Joseph Osai, Texas Edge. Wow, I love these splits by the offensive line. <laughs> What's this view going to look like? That's insane. I love it. Oh, we're losing, Texas. Let's go. He's going to be up there at the top. Stand-up stance. If you've been here the whole time, you know this. If you're new to us, he'll be playing along the line. He'll be playing one of the end spots, and he'll be standing up. Hey, Mo. And he will chase plays down. His motor runs hot. Runs hot. Oh, man, Wesley, like, if you watched a Bosa or you watched Miles Garrett as a college player, first, they're three inches taller, they're 20 pounds heavier, and college football to them was like a video game on rookie mode. Like, they just were so physically dominant, play, play out, ragdolling people. Had an array of pass rush moves. Thank you, Mike. Appreciate that, Mario. Probably terrible, Jeremy. That's why you watch a bunch of games. That's just the first one for him. He's a nice prospect. He's a nice prospect. He's going to need to test well. <clears throat> and I think he will. Probably. If you had to guess off of his tape, he's going to run four, in the four sixes maybe. If he runs a good three cone, that would be great. Because at 6'2 in the 250s, you just you need to test well. Because you're not... Six four two seventy. Feeling good. It's at the top on the line. Oh my goodness, his hands on the ground.
walked him back there a little bit. I haven't seen an inside move from him yet, but again, I think it's kind of tough because there's so much zone read that you're not allowed to run yourself out of the play. Is he out or is he this? I think he's out. When he's out, he's usually out for a few plays. So let's skip ahead. Still out. Oh, I don't know, Jerry. There's there's a lot of edge rushers I got to watch. There's this guy. There's uh, Penn State's got one. Michigan's got one. Miami's got one. And those three are all, at least according to Dane, ranked higher than this guy. I just had some 2020 tape, and it's Texas. So I thought, hey, why not? Let's give a look at it. See, even when moving backwards, he does such a good job of locating the ball carrier and playing as with the ball. It's a good job. Yeah, Don. I got a hand down, is it? Yeah, my ears. Yeah, it's on. Right defensive end, right side of your ring. I actually like him in the three point stance. This is a good player. No, he's not subbed. Is it for this? Oh, sub doesn't even subscribe. Hell yeah. <laughs> Say no. He's in. Right defensive end, bottom of the screen. Standing up. Interesting that he has his outside foot up. Whoops. Never stops. Dude is running. Yeah, Mario, because McCarthy likes him. It's his guy. <clears throat> Whoopsie. I think we'll see him come back in the screen a bit. No, not quite. Tight game here, boys. What are we going to do? Sub everybody out. Forty six stays in. It's a bad number. Could be. Oh, I'm sure that it's based on TCU formation, Wesley. In some way, or just whatever defense they've called. Hell yes, we do, Platypus, because we don't know that Alden Smith's going to be back. Oh, he's out. I don't know if Alden Smith's going to be back or not.
still out. They're about to score for crying out loud. Get in the game. Still not in the game. Game. Up by three. Let's protect boys. Tiger, I have not, but I will get there, I assure you. Let's go, 46. Let's make a play now. Thank you, boy. I'm going to do a lot of these. A lot of players to watch. I won't stream everything I watch, but I'll try to show people a lot of the top guys. Or bears. Run him down. Sir. Run him down. I'm telling you, TCU has a bad plan if they think that they're going to run zone read away from this guy and that he's not going to get there. It's too athletic. You can't do that. Ooh, fire truck. Just can't do it. Stunt. <laughs> He's getting some QB hits on these stunts. In the NFL, he may be getting flagged for these. <laughs> he will be good on with stunts. Whoop. Whoop. Ooh, that's about it. Check your three point lead here, Texas. What are you going to do? Um, no, Jeremy, I don't really do comps unless something just really jumps out at me. I just make my notes about who they are and get them go, go. <laughs> The only opt-out guy I've watched so far, Justin, is uh, Farley. I've done one game with Caleb Farley. And he's interesting, but to me, he's not a top 10 in a normal draft class sort of player. He's a borderline first rounder because of the trades. Oh, yeah, if you opted out, you better test well. Well, some people don't know. Jamar Chase, maybe Mike Parsons. People are so high on them that they're going where they're going. They can skip the combine. We're protecting the lead here, Texas. He's a great help player. He's never out of a play. Double team me. Catch up with him down here. Physical tackle.
Yeah, and I want to see more games, Mr. Chipmunk. I want to see in more games if there's a more traditional offense where he'll show a bigger array of pass rush moves because here what you're just seeing is corner, down the middle, and then the stunts. You don't really see a counter move. Yeah, he's a surprisingly stout run player for his size. Oh, Jerry, I don't care if you opted out. I'm a supporter of the opt out. If you're a college player, you're not getting paid for this. Once your draft stock is secured, I'm not risking my future to play for you, fun. Oh, yeah, blow that quarterback up. Take a shot when you get one. Yeah, Mario, I think teams learn. I think they can have their philosophies about what position's not worth whatever. Bow! Sorry, I thought you had the ball. Uh, you know, when something, when a position hurts you, you'll reevaluate that. Gosh, it's a nice play. He's a good player, man. Watch him work his way down the line here. That's a good player. He's got good potential as a pass rusher. Motors were relentless. Can run. Forceful tackler. Cause some fumbles. Once again, finds his way to the ball. Doesn't stay blocked. Third and seven. Got to have it. So active. What is this kneel down? Is this game over? Game over, man. All right, guys. That's it. That's him. That's one game of Joseph Osai, University of Texas. Maybe we'll watch somebody else tomorrow. Appreciate you guys kicking it with me. Hopefully you're subscribed and following either the Twitch or the YouTube. This one is on both. So I'm getting down right now. And uh, I will catch you guys later on. I'll have another video in the morning of something or other. We'll see. Love you guys.